Hey, what is the people of the internet? It's Shobayovi here with the another video about Call of Duty Mobile Statistical Analysis. Okay, so in this video, we are going to talk about one of the best sniper that I think that this is the best sniper, of course. One shot, one kill, locus. That's what we are going to talk about. We are going to talk about the best attachments for the local uh, locus, and we, if we are going to talk about that. Is it good to use you know locus without any single attachments? Okay, or is it good to use locus with some word of attachments okay so we are going to discuss about everything we are going to discuss about some statistical analysis as well so if you are into this kind of videos if you are into call of duty mobile videos so please make sure to subscribe my channel because this kind of videos i bring for you guys every single day okay so you're gonna enjoy it for sure all right so let's begin without any delay so this is the locus as you guys can see over here 31 level upgrade 31 level uh, uh is uh current level for my locus i'm uh, i'm not uh, playing with locus every single day because currently i am upgrading my uh, you know outlaw one of the best gun as well okay so i have made video about the outlaw as well so please go and check it out the best loadout for the outlaw outlaw is i would say you know 34 level and the locus is 35 level and this gun only you know consists of 34 levels so i'm going to max it out uh, real soon as you guys can see over here currently i have zero attachments over here but my preferable attachment would be i would say the bullet penetration fmj perk because perk are so important in this case okay for example if you are hitting someone so if you have bullet penetration perk attached to your gun so it will penetrate you know more often penetrate more advanced uh, in, in more advanced level so that your uh, so that your target you know does get down so easily okay we are uh, let's talk about muzzle first we are going to talk about the muzzle i think the monolithic muzzle is the one of the best muzzle because with with the help of monolithic your range will be uh, increased but i'm not using anything over right now because i think the uh, even though without any single perk my locus works so fine as you guys can see over here mobility is a little bit decreased it's 51 but still damage is 84 accuracy is 70 and range is 90 one of the best gun okay one of the best gun after i would say uh nf45 and outlaw because nf45 gives a two shot with explosives in it so your uh, your damage will be uh, will be increased along but your mobility will be decreased somehow okay but locus is you know amazing one of the uh, one, one of its kind sniper and let's uh, as you guys can see over here damage is 84 but still you are you are able to kill someone with just one bullet i am going to you know uh, please go over there and watch this video because uh, this is the montage of locus and you're gonna have fun watching this so that, so that you guys can have a brighter perspective about the you know uh, workflow of the locus let's go over here and try this gun and you know uh, let me give some analysis that uh, how much damage does locus make in you know uh, various kind of ranges so for example and this is our training and i would say you should always prefer uh, smrs with the locus because you know it's al always preferable as you guys can see mobility is not this slow mobility is you know amazing as you guys can see over here mobility is still far okay so uh, uh, what, what am i using over here okay for example let's let's talk about the scope over here in this case i am using uh, smg uh, i am using ads okay ads is amazing uh, instead of hip scope so i am not uh, you know uh, using open and uh, short open and close scope i am but when i click on my bullet my scope does open okay my scope does open uh, by itself and let's see over here right now currently we have we are five meter away uh, far from our enemy let's uh, hit on the chest chest would be 140 as you guys have seen man okay even though the damage is written damage on the paper is you know only uh, you know 84 83 but i have just hit it on the chest it said 144 whooping damage 142 okay so enemy is you know dead if your enemy is five meter close from you one shot and boom as you end uh, head shot is 144 to, uh, as well let's give it a shot in the hand hand is 142 as well let's give it a shot to the legs legs is 95 okay but since the locus is you know uh, you are using the ads over here so when you open your scope you 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 uh, you're more likely to open your scope you know around this area chest hand and uh, head but i would say uh, in my case uh, i give most head shot with the locus because you know my uh, aim my crosshair is the like you know straight okay for example this is the enemy and boom and boom as you guys can see over here and boom okay and let's now give it a show to the 10 meter let's see what happens with the 10 meter our enemy is 10 meter far from now right now let's give it a show to the okay so it's the same same uh like five meter okay let's give a head shot is the 142 as well so it does it does not make any difference whether your enemy is five meter or 10 meter wrong uh, okay 
and leg would be 95 okay so in the uh, we have made another video about you know na 45 or uh, outlaw as well as you guys can see over here so uh, basically your damage doesn't make difference whether your enemy is you know 5 meter or 10 meter away from you so now let's check a 20 meter let's see what happens if your enemy is 20 meter far from you but still okay as you guys can see over here since this is a sniper with inbuilt of the i think you know attack scope over here right now so let's uh, you know open the scope and hit to the chest it's a 142 okay does it doesn't make any difference as well and 142 as well all right so what would be the conclusion over here 5 meter 10 meter or 20 meter your locus is going to hit your enemy the same damage that means we can conclude over here hence proved your enemy is going to down you know your enemy is going to be dead whether your enemy is 5 meter 10 meter or 20 meter let's give it shot to the 30 meter let's see what happens when your enemy is 30 meter far from you let me quick reload my locus over here and let all right so it's the same your chest shot with the 30 meter would be the same let me give a shot to the head would be the 142 all right locus is giving amazing performance over here right now as you guys can see over here all right and let me give a shot on the hand 142 nice one locus you are doing so much okay 95 so what will be the conclusion over here whether your enemy is 5 meter far from you 10 meters 20 meters or 30 meters your locus is going to give a damage a very same very much same okay so your enemy is going to get down okay so for example i mean you are hitting your enemy a 142 damage okay he is going to down okay for sure there is no way he is going to stand up in front of you if you are using locus okay let's use 40 meter i think now your damage will be slightly decreased because your enemy is you know 40 meter far from you so oh my goodness no it's giving a same amount of damage 142 head 142 chest 142 no okay it means it missed uh okay it's missed it missed again let me so, 142 head 142 chest 142 hand and let's give it shot to the legs 95 oh my goodness i have discovered a new thing about locus okay this is the one of its kind sniper okay it doesn't happen in outlaw it doesn't happen in the n45 it doesn't happen in dl qq3 it only happen in the locus it doesn't matter how far your enemy is your locus is going to give damage to chest would be the 145 your locus is going to give a headshot to 145 your locus is going to you know hit on the hand of your enemy will be the 145 okay all right so, uh, that was it for today guys you basically i would say uh, now i am changing my views about locus okay in compared to outlaw till yesterday i thought the outlaw is the best but for now and right now i am thinking the might locus will get okay some amount of leverage and advantage in compared to outlaw but still i am continue using outlaw for some days why because i need to get golden outlaw so i i am going to make video about the you know a uh, road to golden kimi of outlaw i am going to make video about the locus as well because i i want to make you know a uh, locus golden as well as you guys can see over here so thank you so much i would say for watching this video if you are new to this video our channel please make sure to subscribe and leave us your thoughts in the comment section below because this kind of video videos i bring for you guys every single day and our battle pass uh, 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 okay other than that our battle plus uh, battle pass giveaway about the season 13 is coming very soon one one giveaway i have finished already i am going to you know uh start and give another giveaway for you guys so make sure to hit <clears throat> hit the subscribe button and thank you so much